Hello? Can you hear me now? Hi, sir. Yes, we can hear you, sir. Yeah, okay. Why is my video not on? I don't know. Sir, uh, your video is off. I see. Your <coughs> kind of... background is one Video is on. Your video is not on, so that I cannot see you. Ah, I can see. Yeah. Yeah, sir. <laughs> no, sir, you, you have a, I have a virtual background, you have a real background. This is a different... Oh, okay, okay, you have virtual. Yes, sir, this is a virtual background. You have heard a good background. Thank you. So just a minute, I think uh, in 10 minutes, we see DC will be available here and we will start them. Just be there. Okay, okay. I mean, sir, check karna tha sab, if everything is all right. Yeah, sorry, exactly. Everything is all right. I can hear you. I can see you. Thank you very much, sir. Thank <clears throat> वो क्या ऑर्डर में चलेगा पहले कौन बोलेंगे फिर वो देख लिया आपने सर डॉक्टर परम इज द होस्ट परमजीत कौर मैम शी विल होस्ट टुडे एंड देन इनॉग्रल एड्रेस विल बी बाय वाइस चांसलर सर देन यू विल बी स्पीकिंग एंड आफ्टर वर्स डॉक्टर बत्रा ही इज डीन एकेडमिक अफेयर्स वोट ऑफ थैंक्स वो देंगे एंड आफ्टर दैट बिफोर वोट वोट ऑफ थैंक्स वी हैव अ डिस्कशन फॉर 10 to 15 minutes on the relevant topic jo clarity ka doubts honge ya clarification chahiye honge koi question honge queries wo raise karenge sir achhi baat hai welcome to the vice chancellor sir ka and afterwards uh, you will be the uh, speaking sir for 10 to 20 minutes okay <clears throat> My speech will be in English, but in between I may say something in Punjabi and Hindi. No, we serve. I'm just going to take some time. Take it. And so, sir, shall we? Hanji, ma'am. Shall we start? No, so, just like uh, we see, uh, sir, I'm here. Just a minute, ma'am. Sir, I'm calling. Uh, then we will really start. Six thirty. Ma'am, six thirty time. We will wait for three to four more minutes. Right. Yeah. Right. Sir, uh, already up in all the way, uh, sir, uh, John Kelly, sir, uh, Dr. Param, she is the host today. She is hosting this webinar. Sikal, madam. Yes, sir. Uh, doctor, uh, sir, Dr. Batra has also joined. He is Dean Academic Affairs. Batra, sir, uh, sir, ne, Dr. Arun has already joined. Kar liya. Okay, okay. Welcome, Dr. Sir. So, thank you so much for joining and uh, spending so much time for this webinar. It's a great pleasure. <clears throat> Sir, uh, five minutes are left. I will be joining us. Just give me two to three more minutes. Please. Sure, 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 sure. sure. Mm -hmm. So we, we, we need to have massive audience so that this is a very useful webinar so that everyone yeah. gets benefited out of this. Right? Yeah. So we have circulated it uh, uh, widely 
in the different uh, social media groups and in our university and the other universities also. Okay. We have also circulated among our audience. Wow, that is... <laughs> There's think, already uh, some people from our group. Okay, okay, right. right. Thank you so much. And uh, we are very keen to listen to you and uh, our honorable <clears throat> Professor Karamji Singh Ji, he was telling very high about you. And uh, I think during this post-COVID period, uh, all these things have become so important that uh, taking care of your health and uh, and uh, how to lead a healthy life, right? Mm -hmm. So, Dr. Sir, you are uh, uh, where you are based now, like in, in which city you are there in U.S.? Uh, I'm in Gilbert, Arizona, USA. Oh, okay, Arizona. So, what is, what is the time there? Uh, it's going to be 6 o'clock. 6 o'clock in the morning? In the morning. <laughs> so, I think you you seem to be early riser. <laughs> yeah, I think you are early phone call from India. So, it's just finished. People in okay. India, they don't know that this is night for us. They yes, call us yes. That's a welcome to <clears throat> that. Uh, I know that uh, it's uh, it must be very early morning. Yes, and, uh, you are with us and we have disturbed you. No, 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 it's nice a pleasure. To, yeah, it's nice to be with us. Because we want to learn many things from you, and uh, it's a topic uh, is uh, very very you know relevant, and important, and our faculty and other uh, members from India, they are eager to you know uh, 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 look forward. I mean that share uh, that what you are uh, um, I mean sharing with us. So I think that um, uh, it is six thirty. We'll start, and uh, how? Sure. Uh, yeah. We have lined up a series of lectures today. Okay. As soon as this is over, then we have one hour class with International Hindu University. Yes, 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 yes. And then in the evening, we have a two and a half hours workshop with the Veda University, New Jersey, here in USA. Right. So right. many more and more universities are going to join this. Yes, yes. Rather, rather. Uh... We are going because I have a meeting with uh, uh, Kulvinder Singh Ji and other fellow. We have a long meeting and mm -hmm. we are looking for, forward to have an interaction with you because through your knowledge, we want to spread the message of, uh, I mean, health or health, uh, natural well being uh, to whole of Punjab and to the masses. Yeah. It's great to see <clears throat> you. Uh, we are regular visitors of Gurudwara every Sunday. Yes, yes. <laughs> Me and sir, my whole family. Yes, sir. This university is named after Jagat Guru yes, Nanak Dev Ji. I know. And 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 you know that uh, the basic goal of Guru Nanak Sahib was uh, it was seva, and uh, and you know that we say that Kirt Karo Nam Japo Vand Chako, and probably what you are doing that is Vand Chako Ali Galla because yeah. I mean that. <laughs> You have a uh, experience, and we are helping uh, other people. And this is the concept of langar, you know, that education langar we will be having with your. Help. <laughs> so, yeah. So I think we have permission. Uh, can we start right, right now, sir? Please. Yeah. Ah. Uh. sir. Ajib, madam, 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 please. Honorable guests of the day, eminent speakers, uh, Professor Karamjeet Singh, worthy Vice Chancellor of Jagat Guru Nanak Dev, Punjab State Open University, Patiala, distinguished dignitaries of the university, members of the faculty, staff, and august audience. A beautiful evening to all of you. I, Parampreet Kaur, welcome you all to the. Thank you. I remember you. Kindly mute.
I, Parampreet Kaur, welcomes you all in the fitness journey with WellCure. Today, we are here for a national webinar on secrets of healthy life. It is rightly said that <clears throat> who has health has hope and who has hope has everything. To deliberate on issues of health, nutrition, and to throw light on some important aspects, we have amongst us Dr. Arun Sharma, founder director of International Institute of Maha Yoga and Natural Hygiene, USA. Sir, welcome. Government of Punjab, with the aim of illuminate lamp of education and awareness in every home across the state, has established Jagat Guru Nanak Dev Punjab State Open University in Patiala during 55th birth anniversary of Guru Nanak Dev Ji. We as a team working hard under the stewardship of our team leader, Professor Karamjeet Singh. Now I request our worthy chancellor, Professor Karamjeet Singh Ji to formally welcome our guest. Sir, please. Thank you, uh, Dr. Prampreet. Uh, see, I, I, on behalf of our university, Jagat Guru Nanak Dev Punjab State Open University, I heartily welcome Dr. Arun Sharma. He, as rightly said, that he, he is a founder director of International Institute of Maha Yoga and Natural Hygiene, abbreviated I, Imana, I-M-A-N-H. See that today, today, Dr. Arun Sharma will talk something about secrets. Now, when we talk about secret, it means that the things which we are not aware, and even if we are aware, right, we are not implementing that. And see, Dr. Sharma, he is an authority. He is an authority in practical nature care. He is authority in natural hygiene since. You see, that let me share with the audience because uh, I had a long meeting with two of his associate, Mr. Kulvinder Ji, and, uh, and uh, other people that we... Sabina, we, Sabina Ji. Sabina Ji, yeah, Sabina Ji. Sabina Ji, we, we, we met in Chandigarh. And, and you know that after meeting her, because I know already about you, because I could, I could understand that you founded this institution in 82 and organized a number of workshop, lectures, health camp, training program for the benefit of youth and uh, I mean adults. And you know that uh, uh, I was when I was discussing, then I requested her that why can't we do something and we can start short term courses for the benefit of uh, our uh, uh, people in Punjab. And I shared this with my faculty and they, sir, they are very excited. They are really looking forward to have an interaction, uh, not only from this seminar, but <clears throat> this is the beginning. We want to share, we want to have a long-term relationship as your institute, your International Institute of Maha Yoga, they had a tie-up with International Vedic Hindu University based in Florida, USA. We also want a similar type of tie-up with our university. And sir, I, I am 100% I am sure that with your blessings, with your experience, with your knowledge, and with your, I mean, so much exposure, we can definitely learn a lot. Because uh, another thing, thing which uh, which other day, uh, uh, Madam Bina and uh, Kulinda told us that uh, they are, uh, Dr. Sharma is, uh, you know, taking not only giving the lectures in his uh, small workshops or uh, small, you can say, they they have a chanting, dancing, singing, and other, you know, all aspects joined together so that make it a memorable type of thing. And I was just uh, uh, looking at uh, the website and the oft-quoted uh, uh, remark of Dr. Sharma, uh, this is coming to, uh, coming to my mind. He used to say that, uh, uh, normally uh, Dr. Sabi is saying that don't check your body. Don't check your body, check your habits. See, sir, we are we are here to learn from you that how to change our habit. And see that uh, it will be an eye-opener for us. I understand it. 
uh, because I already I'm convinced. My faculty is convinced. It will be eye opener because nowadays so much stress is there, so much money is wasted in fighting with diseases, and if we can change little bit of habits, we can definitely. Uh, I mean that we will stop uh, blaming on the climate, environment, or pollution. Right? We can stand over them. So, uh, with these words, sir, I am really grateful to you. We are looking forward uh, that you will give us a some tip and secret, uh, share us a secret about the facts that we are not aware of, and then uh, afterwards, uh, I will take another one minute more. Afterwards, sir. Uh, uh, I, on behalf of my, my faculty, you know, we, we are very much interested. We are very much interested in having starting these courses in our university in collaboration with the, with your institute. Um, we have already talked to uh, your people and um, I am looking forward to have a formal type of agreement with you so that whatever, whatever knowledge you are having that we can spread throughout uh, Punjab and not only Punjab, but in throughout India also. Uh, and student can get benefit of that. And because your philosophy that all living, uh, I mean, being in this world are blessed with creative intelligence, as you are normally say, which is capable of repairing and maintaining and proving our health and all these things. So with these words, I once again express my gratitude to you for, I mean, getting up early in the morning and uh, interacting with us. Thank you, sir, sir. Now, Stage is for you to please uh, uh, give your sermons and give your blessings to all of us. Dr. Sharma, sir. Jo bole so nihal satriya ka. Vahe Guru Ji ka khalsa, Vahe Guru Ki Fateh. Me and my family, we go to Gurudwara every Sunday. And we have, this has been going on for many years. The secrets which I'm talking about is not something which I'm opening up. It's already there in you. Every living being, 8.4 millions of species in this world, they live healthy until their last day. They don't go to doctors, they don't go to take medicines, they don't do anything, but they are able to take care of their health. They also get health problems, they also get injured, but they take care of everything without any help from outside. Sarvam paravasham dukkham, sarvam atmavasham sukham. Dependence on others is a source of misery. Self-dependence is a source of happiness. When you have to depend upon yourself, you don't have any risk. It's safe. It is sure, scientifically proved, and it is eternal. And it has been there from the time of creation. There has been only two kinds of bacteria in the world. One is named, called bad bacteria. They are not bad bacteria. They are our friends. Certain bacteria are scavengers. They come to clean up our body. They eat only the filth in the body. They don't eat the healthy foods. Aham vaishvanaro bhutva praninam deha mashrita prana pana samayukta pachamyanam chaturvidham. In the Bhagavad Gita, it says, I am there as life in you. Guru Nanak Sahib said the same thing. Kahere. वन खोजन जाए सर्वनिवासी सदा अलेपा तो हे संग समाए काहे रे वन खोजन जाए I get so emotional singing this sorry the Idea is I'm already there with you. Why are you going to the forest to do tapasya or to find herbs and medicines and outside from there? I am there in sinew. Sarva nivasi sada alepa tohe sang samai. 
पुष्पमाध्यजो वास बसत है जस छाई ऐसे ही हरि बसे निरंतर घट ही खोजो भाई बाहर भीतर एक ही जानो ये गुरु ज्ञान बताई काहे रे वन काहे रे वन काहे रे वन खोजन जाए the education system in the present world is so much different from the original education system in india original education system was students living with the teacher gurukula it's called we are all worshippers of guru and that's how the tradition was ancient indian tradition is guru is god गुरु ब्रह्मा गुरु विष्णु गुरु देव महेश्वर गुरु साक्षात पर ब्रह्म तस्म श्री गुरवे नम हो माय गॉड दैट इज अ ट्रेडिशन ऑफ इंडिया गुरुकुला एंड पीपल हु लिव इन गुरुकुला दे हैव वन आवर ऑफ एजुकेशन इन द मॉर्निंग एंड वन आवर ऑफ डिस्कशन इन द इवनिंग the whole day they are given freedom nowadays they are loading a ton of books and going to school studying geometry physics chemistry all kinds of subject and when you come home and ask what did you study they don't know anything education is something which you grab which you consume little by little one philosophy a day that's what they used to teach one shloka in the morning and they repeat it and then they do some chores for the ashram clean up and plant, do some planting and all that and help in the kitchen that's all for after some time they are left loose they can wander anywhere in the jungle and do anything they want some people prefer to just lie down and what watch some people like to uh, watch the bees them some people like to they check the plants different kinds of plants on their own they become curious and examine nature around them and then they come to know that different plants are meant for different purposes each bird or each of each animal knows what plants to take as food there is an order of creation यथोत्पत्ति शरीरा वेदाते प्रतिष्ठि जीवनो अनुष्ठान क्रमास्तथा क्रमा इज द वर्ड ऑर्डर ऑफ क्रिएशन व्हाट वाज द ऑर्डर ऑफ क्रिएशन दैट हैज बीन गिवन इन द तैतरीय उपनिषद एंड इट सेस परस्मादव्योम व्योम नो वायुस्तो अनल तंभांसी तत पृथ्वी तत औषध अभवन औषधीभ्यो अन्नमुत्पन्न अन्नाभूता चाभवन अत सर्व शरीरागमे पंच भौतिक दट इज फाइव एलिमेंट्स ऑफ नेचर ये जो पांच नंबर जो है ना ये बहुत ही सिग्निफिकेंट है पंजाब द प्राउडेस्ट स्टेट ऑफ होल इंडिया the healthiest state of all india hamare jo chehra hai wo hamara jo mukut hai wo punjab hai very sad where is that punjab kid ja kapil dev ja milka singh oh bade bade dheer hote the ab to cancer train chal raha hai we should change it and we can change it aapko malum hai ki sab classes mein do kisam ke student mashhoor hote hain there are two kinds of students in every class university or school or anywhere there are two students who are prominent one is a bully wo sabko marta hai meri baat nahi sunoge maar denge i will kick you he is also famous 
another student is a studious fellow who gets very high ranks and he is also popular in one such class in a gurukula <clears throat> there were there was a students who were uh, chelas of this bully this bully is uh, uh, ordering them around and this one fellow is asking you are so smart you are so good but why are you not get good in good grades in the examination why is that fellow getting good grades so he says oh this guru you know he is partial he does he likes that that boy better and he doesn't like me so he gives me low mark and he gives him high marks you know i am smart but you know the guru is like this so somehow this statement goes to the guru by passing of message you know as he snaya se kaha he said this and all that then guru wants to teach him a lesson so he calls him and the bright student both of them he calls he says this is 10 rupees for you 10 rupees for you and good old days you can say 10 rupees was much i mean some i am just giving some figure but they gave him equal amount of money and he says evening 4 o'clock i these are two huts equal size huts this is one your hut this is your your hut they are both of same size and by the evening i will come at around 4 pm and i will check who has filled their hut very wisely you have to fill your hut very wisely and let me see who does it so he gives him money and goes away and he says ah now i got a chance to prove that i am smart so he goes to the market market he is asking the price of this this thing and that thing aata dal ka bhav puchte jata hai where he has bought the so many things but for 10 rupees he is he cannot fill that room with anything and kon acha tar achhe se bharega so he goes on and goes on and he comes to a place where the person is selling one cart load of manure farm yard manure for 1 1 rupee for 10 rupees 10 cart cart load so he says my room is 8 by 10 can you fill this room with 10 10 rupees oh 8 rupees mein bhar jayega wo to i can fill it in 8 rupees so he says come on fill the room he goes cart loads at cart loads of manure he fills the room until it was so difficult to close the room completely filled now let me see how does the other fellow get it i already got all the manure that that fellow had stock and now he cannot win i am going to win so he is very proud but he is seeing the other fellow is not doing anything he is just reading a book and sitting a, without doing anything he says what he is definitely going to lose he thinks after some time the other fellow goes to the market with a small bag and he fills some things and comes back are kaha thela kaha thela Uh, he is only having a bag load and a header, cart loads of thing, and uh, he goes to his own place and waits for guru. When the guru comes, he says, "Come on, come on, see my room. I filled it up every inch of the room. Come and see." He tries to open the room, and all the manure is falling down. Guruji steps back. Whoa! What is this? He says, "This is a fantastic material. By this, by using this, plants will grow very well." and i have not left one space one inch of space in the room see how I, well i filled so give me the price give me the price who says wait wait let's go and see the other person and he says okay let's see when he goes to the other person's room that fellow invites him them both they have got three mats he puts the mats and makes them guru ji sit come on friend you sit down here and he sits in a mat in front of them they have got some pictures of god and they have got a lamp they have got incense burning they have got some fly of flowers and he is chanting something and offering the flowers to god and showing the lamp and and he sings some bhajans in beautiful voice he is singing bhajan and he is asking them to repeat and they are all singing bhajans after the bhajan 
he uh, prostrates on them and gives them <laughs> fruit and some uh, puffed rice and some uh, brown sugar. They mix and give it to them. They all have prasadam. Guruji says, wow, you have filled the room very well. You, you are very smart. Then the other fellow says, I knew it, I knew it. You are always partial to that fellow. You like that fellow. That's why he didn't fill the room at all. And you are saying he filled it very well. He says, wait, wait, don't run away. Let me explain to you. What did you fill the room with? Farmyard manure? Is that something to be put in a room? Can we, we could we, could we enter the room? No. Here he didn't, what did he fill the room with? Nothing. He didn't fill the room with anything. We are, we are sitting here, the whole room is empty. He says, that's how you see it. You see the lamp that he has lit there? The light of the lamp is there all over the room. You see the incense he has burnt? The fragrance of the incense is all over the room. You see the flowers? That fragrance is also all over the room. And the pleasant sight of the flower, lamp, and incense, and God's pictures, and the singing bhajans, it was filling your heart. You were also singing joyfully. You are a great singer, by the way. So, see, he filled our hearts, he filled our bellies, and that food in the belly is going to become blood and going to occupy every inch of your, your body. He filled the room with beautiful things. And still we are also inside. That's what is the secret of health. What is secret of health to do with this? Our body is made up of five elements. Akashad, Vayu, Vayo, Ragni, Agne, Rapa, Adhya, Prathvi. All these five elements are already there in our body and inside body and outside body. Purna Madha Purna Midam Purna Purna Mudachyate Purnasya Purna Madhaya Purna Meva Avashishyate The body is complete by itself and it came from that source of God. That's also a complete. When you take out this complete from that complete, that's also remaining complete. This is a wonderful science given by our forefathers. It has been there from ages and the Granth Sahib has got the collection of all the truths in it. And not only the Granth Sahib, we have a treasure of scriptures. And my grandfather, Acharya Lakshmana Sharma, he did research for so many years, studying the Vedic scriptures and collected information. Everywhere he studied, there is fund of information about health. How to maintain health. And he also saw a, saw a great truth that the so-called disease that people are scared of, people are dealing with day, and, day in and day out. People are talking about this disease, that disease, all that. Some few hundred years ago, there was only a handful of diseases. Headaches, stomachache, diarrhea, constipation, few, few diseases. And we used to cure it without any problem. Langhanam paramaushadam. Fasting is the supreme medicine, they say. When you are upset, your stomach is in pain, why are you putting food inside? Don't put food inside. Allow the body to repair itself. Body has the capacity to repair itself. That is the secret I want to share with you. Every living being has a creative intelligence that is capable of repairing all problems without any external help. All the elements of nature are around us and it, we are taking it inside and that element, those elements help us to heal our body successfully without any side effect. I did, my children particularly want me not to criticize medical system or any other system. Talk only about natural health. So I'm only saying that in this system, there is nothing that will give different kinds of side effects, ill effects. If you take this medicine, you may get, uh, and if your body does, is not suitable, you may get kidney dis problems, you may get heart problems, you may get lungs problems. In an advertisement, that's what they say, all long list 
and quickly they finish it. And if you feel any of those symptoms, immediately contact your doctor. Here, there is no such thing at all. There is no side effect. There is no ill effect. And all the there is only one side effect that is improved level of health. You will have a higher level of health by following this. So we how to use ether, how to use air, how to use sunlight, how to use water. All these methods are very, very simple. Animals knew it, but we have forgotten it. So this natural health science training course will enable each one of you with the knowledge sufficient enough to deal with simple coughing to cancer. Coughing cold to cancer, you can treat them, you can heal without any problem. Punjab has got the biggest problem of cancer, doesn't matter. Cancer is the safest of all diseases. Oh, is it strange? Oh, what is he saying? Is the safest of all diseases until tampered. Don't tamper. I was saying, don't check your body, check your habits. If you keep checking your body, you are doubting the intelligence of the Supreme God. God is protecting you by collecting the toxins in one place. If the toxins are circulating in the body, it will spoil the eyes, it will spoil the ears, spoil the lungs. It's, there is a police force in the body which goes and catches hold of all these culprits. Your, uh, people who are just pickpocketers and small thieves, they are put in a prison for a day or two and then they are warned and they are sent out. But the big murderers, decoys, they are put in a big prison with a thick stone wall and a very good protection. And such is a protection which is called tumor. Don't try to check out what if it is carcin carcinogenic, if it has got malignant or benign, don't want to check it. If you do biopsy, then you have made it more dangerous than it was. Cancer is the safest of disease. There was a Punjabi family in East Patel Nagar where I used to live in Delhi. And there, this old lady was having a tumor, but she did not opt to go to any doctor. She didn't go for any checkup, but she lived with the tumor for six or seven. She was 83 years old. She lived for six more years. When she was 89, she died. And in that pyre, when they were burning the body, there was a violet jet blue jet of fire which just came up and the doctors present there they said oh this is cancer why didn't you bring her to me oh, don't worry about bringing her to anywhere she was living a perfectly healthy life she was doing all household work until her last day that is health you don't have to check your body examine your body cut this cut that no you don't have to do but the cancer can also go away if, if she had followed natural hygiene guidelines. Natural health science has all the guidelines to make you healthy from any state. Diabetes, arthritis, all the names scare the people. Don't worry about all those names. Don't worry about diagnosing your body. Just follow the healthy lifestyle and your health will go better and still better and still better. That's all I have to say. And there are so many people who may have questions. If there is time, we can answer the questions. Otherwise, you can write to us. Thank you. Sat Sri Akal. Such an illuminating lecture, sir. Thank you. After listening to you, I'm sure uh, our faculty members and the participants of the webinar, they have questions. Uh, now the forum is open for discussion. Hello. Hello. Yes. Uh, myself, Dr. Amarji. Sir, my question is Kahire Balkhodan Jai. Is key interpretation kya ho sakti hai, sir? Sarva Nivasi Sada Araipa. We don't search for cures outside. I'm already there within you. All the creative intelligence of God has been given to us. And we, if we just meditate in, inside ourselves, 
the guide, the guru is inside. You don't have to search for him outside. And that guide, that guru will lead you to the correct path. You don't need me to tell you what to do. If you do just fasting, don't eat food, wait for the guru to guide and every guidance will be available to you. Okay, sir. Thank you. Welcome. Sir, one of my students, he is 24 years old, but he's suffering from diabetes, uh, type 1. And he's asking, uh, what are the natural methods that help him to uh, manage type 1 diabetes? Yeah. They're thinking that type 1 diabetes is more dangerous than type 2 diabetes. And they are, they are saying, if you don't give insulin, body cannot make the insulin and it cannot digest sugar and it becomes very dangerous. Every cell of the body is not the same cell which, with which you are born. Your nose, your eyes, your ears, but it is not the same nose which you were born with. They have been transplanted, they have been removed and put another nose. Oh, I didn't know, I was holding my nose. I didn't see when, when it was transplanted. Your heart transplantation, your kidney transplantation has been done six times, seven times in your life. Every three years, the entire body has been changed into an, another body. But the problem is that the new cells that come into the body are not as healthy as the old cells that were there. We have to replace the old cells, sick cells, with healthy cells. Healthy cells come from where? Healthy food, healthy life activities, healthy mind. Your mind also contributes to healthy cells. We didn't know that. There are so many small, small incidents that we do, which we do wrong. When, when your mind craves for something, you just go and grab it and eat it without thinking whether it is good or not, whether it's for your eating time or just resting time. There are so many things that we don't take into consideration in this modern world and we go and live wrong life. So diabetes one is not a dangerous thing he has to be patient. For anybody to follow natural health science, there are three requisites. Vishwasa Shastra Siddhante, Bharanyasa Paratmani, Bhaira Hittimiteta, Trayam Manasa Bheshajam. Treatment starts from the mind. What are the three requisites? Believe in the truths given in our scriptures. Have ab absolute faith in God and entertain no fear, bhairahityam. Com completely remove fear in your body, from your mind. Then you can follow natural health science successfully. Diabetes one can be treated very successfully, but there are steps for that. You cannot give everything in one go, in one minute. They can write to us, they can attend our camps. We, you can organize camps in your, Patiala or Chandigarh or any other, anywhere else. We have our team who will go and conduct camps. And in the camps, you learn lifestyle. And within seven days, you are seeing that you are not taking any insulin, you are not taking any medication, metformin or anything, but you are getting better. You are not feeling any anything bad. Within the one week, you will know it is working. You will not get cured of all the years of disease that in seven days, but you know that you can progress this way for the rest of your life and you don't have any worry about disease. Thank you. <clears throat> sir, am I audible to you? Good yes. morning, sir. Good morning. Sir, uh, uh, sir, I'm from this university, Dr. Shafali from sociology department. So as you were like talking about Punjab, first you start, first you were, saying about Punjab with pride and then you know you had that remorse and pain I could even feel that you know even we you know the people who are living in Punjab we also feel this kind of pain every day that what has happened to this great land a land you know we know that it, it was such a rich cultural land where Vedas were written where Sikhism was developed you know where Guru Nanak walked walked on this land he gave us such beautiful 
values and ethos sir you know i i really want to listen to you that what do you think that what happened what went wrong with punjab so there are two main issues agriculture was the main occupation okay and there the issue came about money if you want to make more money money is the secret of life that's what some people thought yeah. if you want to make more money you have to produce more and if you have to produce more you have to use medicines you have to use artificial fertilizers pesticides to kill the germs or bacteria which comes and attacks the crops they were given wrong direction and they made money they made lot of money they their produce was very good but they did not know there is a, a, a another effect which is very bad every action has two reactions sarvasya dvai phale prayah viruddhe cha parasparam adau chalam phalam paschat theratram bhavet every action has two reactions one is an immediate reaction which stays for a short time another is an ultimate reaction which stays for a long time we are suffering the consequence of ultimate reactions for wrong actions in the beginning the immediate reaction is that we there is uh, too much money to be spent for fertilizer this and that tractors and everything our physical labor is cut, cut down where is, where do we dig where do we plow all those things are gone tractors are there machines are there for uh, harvesting everything is done we don't have to do anything punjab was known for physical labor and they had natural blessings five rivers and all everything was there and if we did not think about money aspect if we wanted to say quality long term benefit will be there will not be so much crop but whatever crop comes there with have it full quality of health and when you eat such food you will have no problem when you are influencing chemicals onto your food food is going into your body for heaven sake think about it stop all the pesticides they won't stop i have to keep yelling shouting giving lectures i broke down in a lecture in uh, what is that khanna i had i was giving a lecture and there were doctors in the audience i could not take it so these are emotional things thank you sir thank you these are indeed very emotional for us as well because every time when we come across such things that you know people are suffering but then you know we have this other narratives you know when people tell these farmers to go for organic farming and everything there are so many organizations that are actually working yes. into these areas yes. but nobody yes. actually why why doesn't come to the <clears throat> grassroots level why farmers are not interested why government is not supporting them you know these are such questions where even farmers feel that you know they can't do anything they they kind of follow the same methods and we are we who are living very near to everything even we could not do anything this is a very the solid... very guidelines very guidelines mm-hmm. is to don't worry about what's happening okay worry about what i can do for it okay let's each of us take a pledge right here and now that we will work for the truth and we will tell people the what is right what is wrong and we will ourselves choose organic foods we will ourselves do fasting we will do our do we uh, improve exercises we will remove our bad thoughts and say good thoughts only inspire people as much as possible hold classes in every school every children must learn not after you grow up from the childhood you can learn i went to a school elementary school they said you have to give a lecture small, small kids the teacher had already told them no noise you have to be absolutely quiet that speaker will speak and then you can only you have free so all the kids had their lips hand in the lips sitting like that i didn't want to give a lecture they won't hear anything they are just to go into make sure that they are quiet so i said i i want to ask you questions and i want wrong answers 
what do you have to do to be healthy? I want wrong answers. Mm -hmm. When I said I want wrong answers, they were all smiling. And this one hand stood up, he says, you have to eat fruits. I said, oh, oh that's not a wrong answer, that's the right answer. The another said, you have to eat raw vegetables. Another says, exercise. I said, you're all saying right answer. Kids know it. Children know everything. But we are giving them lollipops. And when we give a first lollipop, we have done the pop. Yes. That's our thing to begin with. We can change them. We can educate them. We should follow ourselves the right life. And they, can, they will also follow. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Yeah. Hello. Uh, good evening, sir. Hey, good evening, sir. Uh, my sir, Dr. Karan Sukheja. My sir, Dr. Karan Sukheja from the School of uh, School of Social Science and Emerging Technology. School of Very Science good. and Emerging Technologies. Yes. My question is that as we are talking about uh, the always the good health is the mantra for uh, good food is a mantra for a good health. But when we are talking about our new generation. And uh, the maximum of surveys that, that the new generation is suffering from the wheat allergy also. Is there any natural mantra to handle or tackle with the wheat allergy as we have seen the common in the new one? I didn't get the question. Wheat energy, what is it? Wheat allergy. Wheat allergy, allergy. Yes. There was an expert in allergy. There was a world allergy conference. This world expert in allergy was from Pakistan, but he is, he is practicing in Canada. Okay. When, when people asked him, what, how do you describe allergy? He says, do you want my explanation or do you want the scientific explanation? He says, we want, they, they said, we want your explanation. He said, allergy is Allah ki marzi. That means whatever we don't understand, we call it allergy. Yeah, wheat allergy ho sakta, milk allergy ho sakta, lactose intolerance, it can be a dust allergy, it can be a pollen allergy. So many different things may have allergical reaction to you. You may not be able to tolerate it. We have to give special medicines and you have to avoid such foods like that, they say. That is not true. No matter what allergy you are, you are calling about, it's all classified as one column, lower level of health. That's all we have to worry about. Improve the level of health and you will be able to do everything. Not one or two, hundreds and hundreds of cases, allergy problems, they've been solved without any medicine. How did it happen? We didn't know about any medicine. We don't diagnose diseases. We just say, come on, do some running. And when you do running, the circulation is much better. And when you you will get real hunger, after running, you have to relax, relax your nerves, relax your mind, relax your tissues. All those guidelines are there, simple guidelines. But with, by following simple life guidelines and not depending upon others' intelligence for your health, then you will be much more successful. Allergy kush hota. Everything can be solved. Same person. So instead of saying wheat allergy, why don't you see what kind of wheat are we doing? Are we using choker ka atta or do we, I mean, uh, without fiber, they see it white flour is bad. You have removed the useful material and you are using, using dirt. Along with roti, you make muli ka roti, gajar ka roti, palak roti, all those vegetables, you mix it with wheat and then make the roti chapatis. You, are, you will have no allergy at all. Don't use water, but use the paste of the vegetables to mix it with the wheat flour and make chapatis. Wheat allergy is gone. Yeah, that's how I could, I could see from chat box. There are many, uh, I mean, queries from our colleagues. Dr. Monica yes. Patek is talking about the immunity system. Then Pinky yeah. is talking about the mental health. You know that, uh, uh, let me go, because there are so many questions because your lecture, they yeah. have opened up uh, the mind of everybody. And in fact, uh, when I was having a talk with the, 
मैडम संबीना कुलविंदर कुलविंदर एंड एट दैट टाइम आई कुड रियलाइज इट बट बिकॉज दिस इज टिप ऑफ दिस इज टिप ऑफ द थिंग्स इन फैक्ट वी हैव टू लर्न व्हाट टू ईट व्हेन टू ईट हाउ टू ईट एंड देन द वैल्यू ऑफ फास्टिंग देन एज सुबीना वाज टॉकिंग द अदर डे if and she has written on the uh, i mean that on the chat box also that if we are to follow the i mean that uh, yeah, she was writing that date the day each home adopts their farmer and ensures he can go organic and still earn for his family the land the water uh, everything will improve so organic farming i think that there is so many questions uh, because the the, the my uh, my colleagues and my family members they are interested to, to know how how it right. i mean that right. we understand that health is important but how to do go with that how to i mean remove all the diseases all these things and for that i understand it that because i had a talk with the both of your uh, i mean uh, um, sabina and colleagues uh, yeah, yeah. So we will have a practical training and probably uh, uh, our answers or your the food you have given it's a sort of hunger idas that uh, uh, about the knowledge and uh, probably uh, this will uh, we will take uh, further in the next uh, meeting will bother you and your colleague also to come to our university of punjab to have a practical training so that we yes. can have one to one talk and we can yeah, understand right. everything further very good okay. Okay. all the questions all the questions they have now yeah. they can forward it to my email and i will be i will take time to answer all of them sure 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 okay Okay, but because the scope of this meeting may not be for too long, maybe yeah, for yeah, another ten yeah. minutes, fifteen minutes. Yes, yes, yes. We will just waste time. Whatever you you think you can answer, can answer. I understand. I understand. Haji Parampiji, you can do that. A wonderful lecture, sir. Now I request Dr. G. S. Patra, Dean, Academic Affairs, to present vote of thanks. Namaskar, Honorable Vice Chancellor Professor Karamji Singh Ji. esteemed guest of the day dr arun sharma distinguished speaker of today's webinar on secrets of healthy life and founder director of international institute of maha yoga and natural hygiene usa madam sabina kulvinder ji dr amitosh singh and coordinator dr parampreet kaur distinguished guests from india and abroad faculty members and staff very good evening i take this opportunity to propose a vote of thanks on the occasion of national webinar on secrets of healthy life by a renowned scholar from usa dr arun sharma under the leadership of dr sharma international institute of maha yoga and natural hygiene has organized countless workshops lectures health camps and training programs for youth and adults they have sponsored and uh, organized many such cultural event to promote wellness of the entire person in addition to the standard practice of natural hygiene dr sharma considers all aspect of yoga for a healthy lifestyle which he has included in his teachings of natural hygiene the mission of uh, this organization is to bring the knowledge and practice of healthy lifestyle to every corner of the world so that people may be free from various diseases and enjoy long and fruitful life on behalf of jagat guru nanak dev punjab state open university i express my gratitude to esteemed dr arun sharma ji for sparing his valuable time for his scholarly presentation on secrets of healthy life i am grateful to madam subina ji and kulvinder ji for their inputs during the webinar i am grateful to honorable vice chancellor prasikram ji singh for his leadership role in organizing this webinar on a very important area of uh, health sciences uh, in the post covid 19 period i am thankful to the faculty and staff of open university guests from india and abroad for participating in this webinar on a useful topic i am sure that all the participants have been immensely benefited by the proceedings of the webinar at the end i thank one and all i wish you a very nice evening ahead jai hind so we look forward to see you again thank you sasrikal sasrikal
ਸਸਿਕਾਲ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ एवरीवन ਸਸਿਕਾਲ ਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਇਸ਼ਮੀ ਥੀਅਰ ਵਾਓ ਵੀ ਹੈਵ ਐਨ ਆਈਡੀਆ ਵੈਰੀ ਗੁੱਡ ਵੀ ਹੈਵ ਐਨ ਆਈਡੀਆ ਅਬਾਊਟ ਹਾਊ ਮੈਨੀ ਪੀਪਲ ਆਰ ਹੈਵ ਅਟੈਂਡਡ ਥਿਸ ਮੰਥ ਯਾ ਬਿਊਟੀਫੁਲੀ ਡਨ ਵੈਰੀ ਨਾਈਸ ਵੈਰੀ ਵੈਰੀ ਨਾਈਸ ਯਾ the more join in and especially doctors too, that be really really nice tasrika tasrika guru ji good to see you too <laughs> namaste guru ji humme namaste wah aaye bahut acha hello doc sab wo surprise <laughs> you did a great job no no No, always